Hey everybody, today I'm going to show you how to make a simple vanilla ice cream with chocolate topping and walnuts on top of that. <laughs> oh yeah baby, only four ingredients. First thing you got to do here is pour you about a one and a half cups of whole milk in a bowl and add three cups of heavy cream and one and one eighth cup of sugar granulated and one and a half teaspoons of pure vanilla. Okay, if you missed any of that, it'll all be down the bottom. Okay, now once you get it all in there, I want you to ditch the spoon and get a whisk. Okay, very important to get make sure everything that's in that bowl is completely incorporated. Okay, now see uh, as I'm pouring this milk into the ice cream maker here, you see the sugar that's coming out of that. That should have been mixed in real well with the rest of the mixture, okay? Luckily, I have a good ice cream maker that, you know, mixed it all up real good for me and made ice cream. So anyway, once you get it all in there, it only takes about 20, 25 minutes with my ice cream maker, which is only 50 bucks at Costco. Uh, all of a sudden, you have soft serve. And then you turn your old machine off, pull your ice cream out, just like so. Does that look good or what? I remember when I was a kid, you had to turn the dang handle and sit on the thing. You know what I mean? Anyway, what I do is I, I scoop my ice cream off into an old butter container. <laughs> and then I put it in the refreezer to let it harden up and be like real ice cream. Okay? Now, we're going to make some chocolate sauce. And this is so easy. That's about a fourth of a cup of semi-sweet chocolate right there okay and then we're gonna put about a third of a cup of heavy cream in a pan and we're gonna make sure our heat's on low and we're gonna be real patient and take our time and right there we're gonna add one half of a teaspoon of sugar just a half of a teaspoon okay I guess you could put more in there if you wanted to yeah, I wouldn't put too much because these are semi-sweet chocolates to begin with, okay? I always make mine till it gets a little bit shiny on top like that. And I figure it's time to do it. And when it is all incorporated really good, just like that, I want you to take your little jar. That's a, that's a half of a pint right there. That's what it made. And pour it into a jar, okay? And then keep it in your refrigerator. But first... We gotta come out with that vanilla ice cream we made. And folks, I'm telling you, <laughs> this was a hit. Of course, it's just me and the wife here, you know. Uh, but, oh man, this all turned out. It's my first time ever making any kind of chocolate stuff and I just made that up in my head. Uh, I've seen, I've watched two or three people make chocolate and I figured this would work just as good as all that other stuff and it's way easier and it tastes delicious. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> anyway, folks, I'm going to do a, throw me a few walnuts on here, break you up a few walnuts, you know. And man, this was some kind of good ice cream, I'm telling you. Uh, <clears throat> well, we're into 2014, y'all, and uh, going to be a busy year for us, I'm hoping. And I really appreciate all you folks that are subscribing and watching my videos. I really do appreciate it. And if you tell your friends, I would appreciate it also. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but anyway, I could have just sat here and ate that whole dang bowl of ice cream for you. But, you know, I know I can't do that. So. Y'all subscribe and like and comment. I sure do like hearing from you. And y'all have a really good day. Bye.